What's going on everybody, your host AMF1534 here. Welcome back to Let's Play some more Soma. Just got out of the shower, but I'm ready to take another shower of fear. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was really cheesy, but the opportunity was there, so I had to take it. In the first episode of the series, we kind of got all the backstory, uh, finding out our protagonist's name is Simon Jarrett. He was in a horrible life-threatening car crash that killed his friend Ashley and left him with permanent brain damage and so he's been kind of slowly getting back into the ways of life. Uh, he was supposed to meet Dr. David Munchie at this biometrics lab but when we got here come to find out there seemingly is nobody here. Uh, we came back here there's this one door open came in here there's a whole bunch of computers and uh, so we're going to explore around some more to see if we can figure out if there is indeed somebody here or if there is something more uh, sinister going on. As it seems right now, the only thing we can pick up in here is this uh, this power drill. And I don't think that's going to help us out at all, because I don't think that Simon has a uh, specialty in that sort of thing. And we'll go over here to this computer. doesn't look like we can really pick up anything besides maybe one of these bottles of, of Jaws. <laughs> that doesn't sound very tasty. Okay, that's not a good sign. Um, you know, we only tried opening this one door over here. I wonder if maybe one of these other doors will work. No? Well, I guess if any other door would work, it would probably be this one now, wouldn't it? Oh, there he is. Is that him? Oh, hi. Didn't hear you come in. It is him. Simon Jarrett, right? Dr. Munchie? Well, it's uh, just Mr. Munchie, but I'm working on it. <laughs> Actually, you're helping me right now. That does not is make me part feel of very good. Work? Yeah. It's a study I'm doing with my colleague, Paul Berg. We hope to design a gentle way to work with brain reconstruction to help people like you. Oh, did you uh, take the tracer fluid? Yes. Yes, I did. Great. Well, we can start whenever you're ready. Okay, so he's... He's not a doctor. I mean, he is a, he is a, you know, he's an aspiring one, but I don't know if I want to have a guy working on my brain that isn't a licensed physician. Oh, God. I'll do it, though. I mean, what's, what's the worst that could happen? Whoa. Crazy-looking apparatus. All right. Let me just get this out of the way. You are Simon Jarrett, correct? Right. That is correct. Canada, Munchie. Why do I have a really bad feeling that something's going to pop up, like, right in front of right. me, and down there in the hallway? Good. All files in order. Will this hurt? It's just a scan. It'll hurt about as much as getting your picture taken. Indians thought cameras would steal their souls. Is that so? Well, let's hope they're wrong. <laughs> Ready? Say cheese. got a really bad feeling about this. Oh no. What happened? Oh no. This is going to be the most sinister brain picture ever Hello? taken. Mr. Munchie? Did something go wrong? Yeah, something totally went wrong, man. Oh, this Christ isn't funny. on ice. I think that we uh, we may have just made it to that Pathos 2 place that they uh, that they were talking about I'm in the trailer. I'm not supposed to put myself in. This is kind of stressing me out. It it should be, man. This is this is not good. This is in no way, shape, or form the room that you were just in. What is this place? How did I get here? I don't know. I got a weird feeling. Oh boy, there's blood. I just need to stay calm. No need to make things worse. Oh, dude, my my skin's starting to tingle right now. This isn't good. Better question is, where did where did uh where did Mr. Munchie go? And why are there two of those suits missing? Pathos 2, yeah, we're at that Pathos 2 place. Insert Omni tool to access. I'm gonna guess we probably don't have one of those. So what is this thing really for? I it uh, got a bad feeling. Okay, so can we just go out this room, or what's going on? No? Okay. Um... Well... 
This window's cracked. Maybe I can throw this thing at it. Oh, I think we can. It looked like it cracked some more. Ha ha ha! You know, I probably was actually safer to be in here, but might as well, for the sake of, of exploration, let's let's do it. Okay. Time for everything that I never wanted to have happen take place. Here we go. Welcome to Pathos 2, my friends. Any takers on how long it'll be before we see something that we weren't supposed to? I'm calling five minutes. Got a lot of dripping going on here. Whatever was supposed to be in this thing is not there. I gotta give all the credit in the world to the people that actually decide to, you know, work in facilities like this where, where you're isolated away from everybody for extended periods of time. It does not sound like my cup of tea at all. Pneumatic seal. Oh, yeah, that's, that's, that's great. There's probably a very good reason for this room to have a seal like that on it. Picking up some, I'm picking up some weird like interference in my headphones. I wonder if that's like a signal, kind of like how they do in Fear, where like everything starts to get all like blurry and whatnot. What the hell? What's going on? Hey you, can you talk? Can you talk like the others? How is this thing talking to me? Some structure gel? Yeah, you do. So weird. Doesn't make any sense. I'm gonna shut you down now, okay? Yeah, you're creepy as hell, so I'm gonna shut you down. How did I do that? That's a, oh no. That, that's, a, that's a great question. What the hell's going on? I don't know what I'm hearing or where it's coming from. I got a feeling I shouldn't be in this room right now. Either that or I need to close the damn door <laughs> so that nobody can come in here. Okay. What the hell? So either the robot itself was talking to me or it's like reliving the last moment that it was operational when somebody that was actually working here was working on it. Okay, I think we do need to get out of this room. Oh boy, I, I'm not, I'm not feeling, ooh, okay, so. Oh, so hold the right bumper. Oh, the right one, okay. Okay, there we go, that's what I, I just <laughs> apparently forgot how to, how to read there for a minute. Was this like this a second ago? I don't recall it being like that a second ago. I mean, something just went fucking crazy in here. Okay. Really quick. Let's, uh, let's take the pneumatic seal off of this door as well. I don't like how that thing just falls on the ground like that. It's weird. Oh, okay, so we're back in here again. Okay. I see. No wonder why that door wouldn't open. It had a full seal on it. Okay. Here we go. Looks like we don't really have a choice now. We gotta, we definitely gotta go over here. We gotta examine what's going on. <laughs> I feel so uncomfortable right now. This is, this is just not, this is not a place I want to be. Okay, I thought, I thought that I heard like a person's voice coming through that. Apparently not though. Can't talk to you. Matsu. Kind of reminds me of uh, Commander Amatsu from uh, the Hellbender game on uh, Windows 95. Oh no! What the hell? Being noticed by what? Or who? Would be a better question. 
Who the fuck is here? Uh, oh my god. <laughs> I need to get out of this room right now. Holy shit, I gotta take the pneumatic seal off of that door. Oh, oh no! Oh god! Oh no! I have... Somebody here? Somebody here? No? Please tell me the answer's no. I don't want to put up with any... Oh, shit. Come on, pneumatic seal. Let's go. You and I need to, we need to we need to leave this area ASAP. Oh boy. Um door close, please. Yes. All right. Oh my god. This game's going to be the end of me already. My blood pressure is not acceptable right now. Oh, this is that Omni tool thing. Awesome. AI helper gene. Okay, and that's for our inventory. How do we access items from the inventory? Or will it just be used when they're needed to be used? Hopefully that's the case. The last thing I'm going to need in this game later on is to be fumbling around through my inventory trying to get an item when I'm being chased by something. Okay. Now we got to be extra stealthy on the way out. Because obviously something is here. And it's impeding my progress between here and back to the room we started in. Oh boy. Oh boy. Am I supposed to... I think I might need to be going that other way. I think I should probably stay crouched though. I don't feel like it's a very smart idea to be walking upright. Let's go this way. Maybe this will be like a shortcut back to the room? Not likely. This may be a terrible choice in the long run. What the f No, no, no! What's that? What's th Please let there not be anything coming out of there. Oh boy. Okay. Alright, you have my attention. Not, not the song by Copeland, but... Oh my god, I don't like this place at all. This place is... is so unsettling. In many, 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 many ways. Okay. So... It does look like there are some places to go here, but we need to go all the way back to insert that Omni-Tool. If I find out that our character has infinite sprint, I'm gonna be so excited right now. Oh shit, oh no. Oh god. I'm pretty sure... Pretty sure I just saw somebody walking down that hallway. Okay. Which room is the room we started in? It's definitely right over here. Close the door, close the door! Not like it's really gonna help any, because the window's smashed out, but... Oh my god. Oh, nope, nope. Gotta put it right there. Because, you know, all the noise in this room isn't going to be a terrible idea or anything. Service console up to room 3, including pilot seat activated. Pilot seat? Remote access denied servers offline. Main power suspended. Emergency systems 13 days remaining. Until what? Three progress scan. Simon Jarrett terminal scan. Oh. So. This is. Okay, we're definitely still in the seat. That's. At least wherever we are at the moment. Let's unlock the toolbox. Your Omni tool is in perfect condition, but not fitted with a tool chip. Note that without a tool chip, your kit will be unavailable, including your cross-site security access. Okay, so let's get this tool chip and put it into it. Tool chip found. Okay, let's update that bad boy. 
I'm assuming that'll probably give us security clearance through uh, one of those doors we found at the other end of the hallway before we came back in here. Please remove Omni Tool. Sounds good to me. This looks like it's going to be probably the most important item that we have for a little while. However, I think this is going to be a good place to stop for the moment because I really don't want to go back out there right now. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, this dude, I'm loving the environment and the atmosphere of this game so far. It, it's it's already making me feel extremely not good about what's to be happening later. So, when we come back on the next installment of Let's Play Soma, my friends, we need to uh, make our way back across the uh, the hallway to probably go into one of the one of the doors that we saw at the other end uh, before things started getting a little uncomfortable. So. Until then, my friends, this is your host, AMF1534, saying thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time. Take care, everybody. Bye.